all of class 3 today in maths chapter 7 measuring we will deal with measuring capacity measuring capacity the quantity of a liquid which a container can hold is called capacity so what is capacity the quantity of a liquid which a container can hold is called capacity so the quantity of liquid which a container can hold is called capacity now standard non standard units of measuring capacity non standard units of me measuring capacity which container has more capacity now look here here is a jug and a flask these are filled with water now to know how much liquid a vessel or container can hold before the liquid into smaller identical vessel will pour the liquid in smaller identical vessels vessels so that we will know which container has got more liquid inside it now from the jug i pour the liquid and it, the liquid filled in how many glasses 1 2 3 4 5 6 glasses so from the jug i could fill 6 glasses here from the flask i could fill 1 2 3 glasses only so which container has got more liquid inside it the jug has got more liquid inside it can fill in six glasses whereas the flask can fill up only three glasses therefore the jug contains more liquid than the flask in capacity we are going to learn standard unit of capacity your standard unit of capacity liquid is usually measured in liters or milliliters so liquid is usually measured in either liters or milliliters Liquid is measured in liters and milliliters. The standard unit of measuring capacity is the liter. The standard unit of measuring capacity is the liter. In short, we write L. Liter is written as L. Now, usually we measure liquid using a marked measuring can. So here you can see a measuring can. Usually we measure liquid using a mark measuring can. Here you can see liquid inside the can. So the liquid is still 1 liter, 2 liter, 3 liters. So the how much liquid is there in this can? 3 liters of liquid is there inside this can. So this is a measuring can to measure liquid. The capacity of the given vessel is 5 liters. The total capacity is how many? 5 liters. It can measure up to 5 liters but how much liquid is there in the can? 3 liters your milliliter is the smaller unit of capacity so like in kilograms and grams we have grams as a smaller unit of measuring weight your milliliter is the smaller unit of capacity in short we write it as ml milliliter is written as ml we measure the smaller quantities of liquid in milliliters we measure the smaller quantities of liquid in milliliters. Here, here, the capacity of the given vessel is how much? 100 ml, 200 ml, 300, 4, 500. So, the capacity. Capacity. is 500 ml that is 500 milliliters so it can measure up to 500 milliliters here in this measuring can how much liquid is that 300 ml that is 300 milliliters so these are the standard unit of capacity we measure capacity using liter or milliliter so liter is written as L in short and milliliter is written as ML. Measuring capacity, we are going to learn about relation between liter and milliliter. Relation between liter and milliliter. There are 1000 milliliters in a liter. How much milliliters are there in a liter? There are 1000 milliliters in a liter. So there are 1000 milliliters in a liter. So 
so 1000 milliliter is equal to 1 liter 1000 milliliter is equal to 1 liter therefore 1 milliliter is equal to 1 divided by 1000 liter so 1 milliliter is equal to 1 divided by 1000 liter which is equal to 1 upon 1000 L so 1 milliliter is equal to 1 divided by 1000 liter so you have to remember that there are 1000 milliliters in a liter now here the standards as vehicles vessels used for measuring liquid liquids are shown here these are the standard size vessels which are used for measuring liquids now 50 ml 100 ml 200 ml 500 ml and here you can see liters also 1 2 3 4 5 these are the standard size vessels which are used for measuring liquid these are used to measure liquids and remember that 1000 milliliters is equal to a liter that is 1 liter or and 1 milliliter is equal to 1 divided by 1000 liter that is 1 upon 1000 liter okay i hope you understood the relation between liter and milliliter